So, the numbers and the D shape. So if we, we take a garden variety D and we slide it up, D, D sharp, E, F, F sharp, G, it just keeps going. C is another good one. But let's pick on just the D shape for the G chord. Now, of course, what's nice about this is that the one sticks right out front, but the numbers are, and you should practice them with each finger per fret, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one, seven, six, five. So those are, the, and actually, if you start with the C shape, one, three, five, seven, that's a, that's a C shaped G, just like you play the C back here, but it's been, it's up higher. You never play that, but recognizing the numbers, one, seven, one, three, four, five, six, seven, one, that's a major seven. And what's cool about this is a lot of cool stuff. There's bending the one to two, one, one to two, bend it. Um, sliding the five to the six, hammering the two. But what's really cool to do here, and you just have to memorize it, is to have open phrasing and skip notes. And it sounds like this. this shape, I mean, it's So there there's uh, one example. All those songs are uh, major chord tones, all of them. <laughs> 